Oh my goodness. I'm trying to do a video. Hush. Hush. You can sit there, Kimber. You can sit. You can sit. Sit. No? Okay. I wanted to show y'all my outfit of the day. The shorts are my husband's shorts that I cut up. These are just, I don't know what kind of brand they are. Oh, or whatever this brand is. I don't even know. Like, whatever that brand is. I want to say it says David Bitten. So, yeah. And it's just like his pants. And they had a rip underneath one of the pockets. And so, I just cut it up and washed them. And now they're cute. Somewhat high-waisted shorts. So, yeah, they're kind of sticking to me because I just took a shower. But once it dries up, they kind of fit a little bit higher up. Like right here. So, oh, you can't even see. But they fit a little bit higher up. So, I like them. They're flattering. They look nice and comfortable. And they look expensive to me. Like, they look like some Urban Outfitters shorts. So, and then I'm wearing just this loose top that I got from, well, this was given to me by like a friend or whatever just getting rid of clothes but I got this top or this top is found at Walmart by Massimo and then I'm just wearing my hair loose and natural and I have my scrunchie because my sister-in-law likes to ride with the windows down in her car and then I did a little bit of light makeup I put covergirl matte clean underneath the eyes I put covergirl like lash blast on the eyelashes and then on my eyebrows I just got a powder from the Jaclyn Hill palette and I think it's called Central Park or whatever and I put it on my eyebrows so yep now I'm off to go spend the day and then these shoes are I got them on Amazon if you look up Polly shoes p-a-l-i shoes you can find these but soon I'll be having some Crocs and I'll be wearing the crap out of some Crocs because I really want some so bad but I don't know if I should get white or black so Y'all see in a little bit. Well, not in a little bit. I won't get some. I'm going to order Crocs online so I can get the ones that I want. Because I want the old-fashioned looking ones. I don't want the newer ones where they're just like weird looking. So, yeah. But that's my outfit of the day. Going to go run some errands with my sister-in-law. Okay. I'm wearing a sports bra. Mm, a little bit too low, though. Uh, I wanted to give y'all a little body update. I'm wearing leggings. Sorry, there's something going on with the door. But I'm about to show you why. I'm wearing leggings, but, but okay. my neighbors are probably thinking, what the heck, this girl, but this is my body update. My stomach is still kind of big. I wish it was smaller. I'm going to do more ab workouts today, but my arms, I'm pretty much happy with my arms. They're not too skinny. They're not, to me, they're not chunky looking. Hold on, let me show you this arm. So, it looks fine. I feel like the camera makes it look... 10 times bigger because in real life, my husband says that my arms look totally fine. <laughs> Pose, they all can see, but whatever. I want to put a shirt yeah, on. This now. is my outfit of the day just a t shirt, my pants, my yawning. <sighs> but as you probably already realize, there is actually, there's an actual rug on this. Floor and hold on, let me clean it real quick because I don't know what's going on over here. Okay, I had to clean up some stuff. But anyways, the reason why the door won't shut is because of the rug. So, I'm going to scoot it down just a little bit. finally yeah looks good so let me show you what it looks like with the curtains closed or with the curtains open first so yes my office space is a little messy but this is 
when you walk in, this is what you see. So it's a nice big carpet. And please don't look at our room. Our room's also messy. But you walk in, it's this nice little gray and white carpet. Kind of matches with everything in here. So it's white shiplap walls and gray curtains. And then, even though the light's on, it's really hard to tell. Alright, let me turn this thing on. It helps a little bit. Let me brighten it up. Okay, so when you turn on up the brightness, and if I'm... Sorry, the room's not big enough for me to show you everything. But, there's... All this stuff. Maybe if I turn off the light, you can see a little bit better. Oh, that's a little bit better. I might show y'all at night. But, I like it. It's nice. It's a little bit busy for a rug for me. But, Josh surprised me with it. He, We haven't even talked about it, really. But, Josh and I haven't even talked about this rug. Because, I... What was it? I guess, he was with a friend yesterday. And with another friend. And I was with one friend yesterday. And, um, I just came home late last, well, I say late. I came home at 1030 last night and Josh was already asleep for work. And I looked down and there's a rug in the room and I'm like, holy crap. And it's a really comfortable rug too. It's really cushiony. I don't even think he has, um, yeah, there's not even, <laughs> there's not even a rug cushion underneath this. And this rug is already cushiony. Totally forgot to have leftover pizza in the fridge. So I'll be eating that. So we do have some sides. Josh has a pizza. There's deer steak in here. There's chicken. Ooh, there's pork chops. Pork chop. Combo by sirloin chops. Yep. That's what we're having tonight. I put that in the window seal and I'm gonna do some dishes. There's really not a lot of dishes. I was gonna freak I was freaking out it was gonna be a lot of dishes, but I wanna make some coffee this morning. So, so let's do that. Oh, and I might be watching this all day. It's Audrey Hepburn. I got a seven movie collection and it has Breakfast at Tiffany's Funny Face, My Fair Lady. Paris when it sizzles, Roman Holiday, Sabrina, War and Peace. I, I've watched Breakfast at Tiffany's, Funny Face, and I think that's it, or Roman Holiday, and that's it. I want to see My Fair Lady, Paris when it sizzles, and um, Sabrina and War and Peace. But I want to know the one where she sings Le'Veon Rose. I don't know if that's any of these, but I got her movies and I want to watch them today. So I'm probably need to get the PlayStation to start. Ooh, ooh. My new favorite one right now is the Stella Rosa. If you do not want like a hangover or like a huge wine headache, or if you just want a buzz, this stuff, that, it'll give you that. Like, hold on, I'm trying to see how much percentage alcohol there is. Oh. But it's an Italian wine, so you know it's good. Okay, 5.5% by alcohol volume. Serving size, six fluid ounces. But I like using this one, or I like drinking out of this one, because I do get a buzz, and uh, I do get a little tipsy, but I'm not nauseous or anything like that. Like, it's really nice to enjoy your wine. Also, my sugars stay relatively low. Like, I had a glass last night, and I can show you what my blood pressure looks like today. 
also need to go check on the dogs because they're outside, if you haven't noticed. They're outside in their pen. My uh, friend, her nephew, he would say hand sanitizer because he didn't know it was hand sanitizer. Okay, so it's at 91. I keep doing that. I'm the world's worst about not having a paper towel next to me when I do this. And I always put it on my shirt. So, I'll put it in. Oh, that has to come off. Okay, I'm gonna go to the store now. I'm gonna message Josh asking if he needs to anything from the store. And I'm gonna get some um, monsters so I can drink those throughout the week. And then, Maybe get some stuff for dinner. We should have enough sides for the next few days. But I'm also gonna get some of the meats and stuff because they sometimes have like four for 20. So I'm gonna do that. But I'm gonna message Josh. Okay. Wait. All right. Hold on, I need to. A... I got some vanilla Diet Cokes or vanilla Coke Zeros. But I wanted to show y'all what else I got. I got some chips for snacks and stuff. And let me go ahead and put this meat up. I got two things of steaks. They're like really, you can't even see me. Um, I got some combo round steaks. So I got two of those. I got some chicken. I always get chicken with bones because it just tastes better when it has bones in. I got some drumsticks for me to uh, bake one day. Chicken thighs for me to also bake. And for Josh, even though we don't have any kids or whatever, I still like to celebrate Father's Day and Mother's Day. Um, Josh kind of, you know, tells me Happy Mother's Day even though I don't have... We don't have kids or anything, but kind of when you're going through, you know, not we're not trying to have a baby, but we're not trying to prevent it. Um, it's kind of like if it happens, it happens for us right now, but doesn't mean I always feel left out when it's Mother's Day and I feel like I could be pregnant by then or whatever. And I get a little bit depressed around Mother's Day just because it's a long story, you know, Mother's Day. I, I wish I could celebrate Mother's Day. It's a holiday that kind of like that makes you feel excluded especially when you don't have kids when you really want to have kids but I want to do the same for Josh you know since it's Father's Day we don't have any kids I got him some grilling tools so I got him this big spatula and I got him these tongs my sister-in-law showed me these yesterday when she was grilling and yeah so really good tongs and I think they're really cool because you scoop underneath it, close it, flip it, and then these, he can, whichever one he wants to use. So, I'm going to put these in the drawer and have him look in the drawer. Oh, that was I thought they weren't going to fit, but they fit in the drawer. So that could be his new grilling drawer. He has a drawer just for him and his grilling stuff. I also got some odorless lighter fluid. This was just the only lighter fluid that they had left. It was $3 for this huge thing at Berkshire's. And then I got some stuff for Josh's lunch. I want him to try out one of these. They're ham and Colby sandwiches uh, he can take to work. He doesn't have a microwave. He's always out in the truck when he's working. So I wanted to get him one of those. That way when he actually gets to lunch, it would already, already be thawed out and ready for him to eat. I got some more almond milk. I get, this one's the vanilla unsweet. I like the vanilla unsweet one. Um, they actually have new packaging because this is what it used to look like. I don't, you can't even see. This 
is almond peanut butter or whatever that I have, but I didn't buy that. Um, I got the Holy Guacamole family size. And then I got the cashew queso that I got last time. So this one is the mild nacho. So this is actually a uh, yellow cheese cashew queso that I wanted to try. And then I got some garden vegetable uh, cream cheese. Yes, this is you know non-dairy or this is dairy i was going to get the non-dairy um cream cheese but i didn't know how i would feel about it and i didn't want to waste money on it so that in there and then i got some these these we've been doing a lot of grilling here lately and we always have leftovers so I needed big bigger bowls to put um, like steaks and pork chops in that in there. I got some Gatorades for Josh to take to work I'm eating this for lunch I was gonna eat some taquitos for lunch but I'm gonna save those for the week we actually have sausages from our last time we did. Put this out. You take this out. This big old thing of monsters, because I've been drinking a lot of monsters here lately for work. Because getting back into the groove of work, it's very tiring. So instead of me buying a bunch of monsters a week at work, I just went ahead and got a 10 pack. But I'm not, I'm only going to drink once. One every two or three days. There's that. And then I have. What the hell is that noise? Let me shut that. And then I got some vanilla cups. Did some laundry, had to rewash the dishes in my dishwasher because if you leave dishes in the dishwasher too long, they do get dirty again because they get mold and stuff from all the humidity in there. So that is a thing. So I re had to rewash all those dishes. So I'm gonna go in my room, eat some lunch, watch some YouTube videos, do some knitting and maybe do some crocheting or do some crocheting, maybe do some knitting and See what we're gonna do from there.